This is Twit. We talked about this a little bit, but uh, earlier today, Micah Sargent and I, with great effort, managed to make a FaceTime call. And yes, in fact, it's a little creepy. His eyes do, even if he's looking at the picture, appear to be looking straight at the camera. I think that's a good thing. I'm glad. It makes that. me doubt what is real, Leo. I don't know what's reality anymore. It's yeah, very see, disturbing that, that, to me. That's, on a core level. that's my problem. That's my problem with it. I don't. It's a very obvious and a very very natural feature to put in, but I think that it's kind of a binary thing. Either you trust that FaceTime is giving you a picture of the thing that the camera is looking at without emendations, or it is enhancing things to make sure that the person is looking at the camera, or saying that oh Andy didn't shave like this morning, so let's just sort of like yeah. tone that down so it looks like he shaved. It's uh, it's when, when you're talking about a basic communication tool. I know that this isn't the most important thing in the world, but it just is, again, it's binary. Either the app is not changing anything to trick you into thinking that reality is uh, not what it is, or you accept that, yes, maybe this person does not have kitty ears and, and, and cool sunglasses. <laughs> I just I just think that... Uh, I just kitty like ears it. and sunglasses, at sleeping? least you know Are that's a super on the call? in position. Is it but, adding yeah. eyes? I don't think yeah. if you... Well, actually, we didn't try that. Close your eyes, see what, see, see what happens. I didn't try that. that should, we should just paints the eyes right on there. He's like, my, my <laughs> mic was stoning. You didn't hear it. Right think of the, the money we'll save on ping pong ball <laughs> eyes and googly eyes for those boring meetings. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. I would love it if it made me look 15% smarter, but at a certain point, it's just deception. It's kind of the next thing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's it's can, can interesting. I, it's not. It's very innocuous. It's it's not. <clears throat> it's not a danger. It's not like trying to um, beautify you. You know, remove your 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 pimples or whatever. All it's doing is it's sort of shifting your eye focus so that it looks like you are actually making eye contact with the person that you're talking to. But at the same time, like that is, it's false. It's false. You know, um, visualizing. So it, it, it's kind of, I'm kind of on both sides of the spectrum of it because I do, even when we have our, our conversations, if I'm not looking directly at the camera, I'm looking slightly above or slightly below the camera. And I try really hard when I'm, I'm the one conversing that I look directly at the camera. But um, most people will start to just kind of wander and look, look away, look down at the, at, the, at the screen instead of looking at their camera. <clears throat> and that you know, it's I, the idea that it can fix that problem for me is great because it makes a conversation feel more intimate, but it's, it's false. So, you know, when, when are we, you know, when are we letting technology replace our own human natural um, movements and gestures? And, and like, when did, do, when does that line, when is that line? Okay to draw, you know, is it okay that it's just shifting my eye focus? And then in that case, just like you're saying, will it then someday be okay to make it look like I've shaved and when I haven't removed tattoos? And Georgia said that she can't you know? tell, like she says, usually when I look right, I'm lying and left, I'm remembering and she oh. can't tell now. Yeah, those tells so are it might gone. be good for me, but bad for her. Yeah, yeah all your body, yeah. you lose a lot of body language because sometimes people are looking off yeah. and, no, and all, all those point. things give us cues as to how we communicate with each oh. other. Well, here's the good news. You have to turn it on. First of all, you have to download the latest iOS 13 beta if you want to try this that came out yesterday. And you have to turn it on in the settings, the FaceTime settings. Uh, there's so I have a big conundrum for you, though, Leo. Like, should you be the one to turn it on or should I also be allowed to turn it off? Like, if I say I don't want FaceTime lying to me, uh, you know, because there, there was that, that whole uh, superhero male, uh, superhuman male thing where, you know, you, like, do you have, should they lot track you? Should you not be able, should I, like, what if I just never want FaceTime to lie to me? Right. Should I have that? Should I have that setting too? Uh, should it override your setting? I don't know. Uh, is there ethical or, even, or even just, a, or even just a, if you a, a get info window that will just superimpose. By the way, here are features that the that the person who's sending you video is turning on. That these please, please mute any keyboard sounds. Uh, please uh, adjust the eye frequency. Please make sure that the mouth seems to be my resting face seems to be happy as opposed to exhausted <laughs> and frustrated. Actually, uh, I know, would I'm pay sure. for mute keyboard so, sounds. That would be a really handy plugin. But it's so yeah, complicated because yeah. like. When when they had the Google duplex, some people were saying that you should absolutely have to disclose it right. and you should know that you're not talking to a human. But other people are like, what? should I have to tell you if I'm using an artificial leg? Like if I'm mute and I'm using Google to speak for me, what, how is that your business? And none of these have easy answers. Yeah. So I wish that when companies would do these features, yeah. they would start off these conversations as well. I like the info screen. I think that's a good idea. So you at least know what's being what. I, and as we get better and better at this, you're going to see a lot. I have a feeling Apple's just doing this to show off AR. AR plus, yeah. <laughs> right? This is just, look what we can do.